Or at least half of it. Come on. Get it back with shielding intact. I'm just gonna let them come to me. Such an asshole. Let's see if I can stick that other freaking silver elite. I won't be able to, considering he's moving around all over the damn place. Hey, I got him! Nice. Oh, God! Ugh. Game, really? Stick the two elites that are causing me problems, then you blow me the fuck up anyways. Fail. Oh, God damn it. You guys are determined to get me to blow up, aren't you? And right between the legs once more. Stay out to the side. Didn't get him. Now, I'm sure some of you people are wondering, am I going to show off the secret, uh, the secret ending that you only get after completing the entirety of the game on Legendary difficulty? The answer is yes, yes, I'm going to show that off, but I'm going to borrow it from someone else because I do not want to play back through this game on Legendary. <sighs> There's supposed to be a rocket launcher somewhere in this mission, but I have never found it. I think I got a couple of them with that one. almost every single one of my grenades, but at least a good chunk of you assholes are dead, with the majority of my health still intact. I'm impressed. Now, if the game would be oh so oodly doodly kind as to give me a checkpoint. Thank you! Let's see. Yes, it's this way. Health pack I didn't need, the but after the cutscene that's coming up, away. it's gonna be a moot point. Like that elite! Oh. Upload me. 
the instant control. Got all of them. The terminal nice. is located next to the main view screen. Oh, checkpoint time. I leave home for a few days and look what happens. This won't take long. There. That should give us enough time to make it to a lifeboat and put some distance between ourselves and Halo before the detonation. I'm afraid that's out of the question, really. Oh, hell. Ridiculous! That you would imbue a warship's AI with such a wealth of knowledge? Weren't you worried he might be captured or destroyed? He's in my data array, a local tab. You can't imagine how exciting this is! You have a record of all of our lost time. Human history is fascinating. Oh, how I will enjoy every moment of its categorization. To think that you have destroyed this installation as well as this record. I am shocked. Almost too shocked for words. We start the self-destruction. Why do you continue to fight us, Reclaimer? You cannot win! Give us the construct, and I will endeavor to make your death relatively painless and... At least I still have control over the comm channels. Where is he? I'm detecting taps throughout the ship. Sentinels, most likely. As for the monitor... He's in engineering. He must be trying to take the core offline. Even if I could get the countdown restarted... I don't know what to do. How much firepower would you need to crack one of the engine shields? Not much. A well-placed grenade, perhaps, but why... Okay, I'm coming with you. Chief Sentinels! Alright, your best bet for this? Just get the fuck out as fast as possible. Don't even bother with those sentinels. Damage when it Head to the cryo chamber. I the guarantee they the aren't gonna there. follow me. At least when I made my run through earlier, they didn't. So now we've got the wrong weapon equipped. Because the cutscene, for some reason, automatically changes your weapon. With a freaking assault rifle. And lots and lots and lots and lots of blood. Shit, 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 shit. That was almost bad. Back off. Back off. Yeah, this was not a fruitful checkpoint. But the good news is, if you manage to survive this onslaught of the Flood, you can... Okay. If you manage to survive the onslaught of the Flood, you get some more shoddy ammo, which is beautiful. Or, or not filled up my shotgun ammo the last time I, or when I made my run through this earlier. I guess they decided that I don't need shoddy, oh! That's a little bit of shotgun ammo, but... It's... Apparently they think I don't need it. And, once again, in cases such as this, if you see two sides fighting against each other, let them duke it out amongst themselves for a couple seconds. Then pop out and take out the victors. Or, you can just do what I'm doing and just run the fuck through. They ain't gonna follow you anyways. I think, however, I did miss my chance to get some overshield. would have been very useful. More shotgun ammo would be very useful as well. Just let 
these guys have their fun for a few seconds. Hey friend, you die. Thank you. God damn it, back off. Boring area. Just kind of move on. Generally, the sentinels won't shoot at you, so you can just kind of push your way past all of that, keep going, kind of thing. Of course, be very careful you don't get motherfucking ambushed like I just did. Oi! Back off! Yeah, if you got one of those mother boomers around, definitely take advantage of blowing them up yourself or getting close to them so they'll go on an attempt to blow up all over your face. Because, uh... Certainly clears enemies out fairly quickly. Now I know this seems like it's a infinite onslaught, but those guys do eventually stop attacking. Eventually. And then I blow myself up. Not only may I pass now, sir? Motherfucking grenades! Lots, lots, lots of explosions. Like it's fucking Fourth of July. And then I'm gonna die because of a goddamn needler. this much. However, that does make things easier. Now, assuming I don't blow myself up once more, let's see if I can make it through the area. Nope, apparently that was bound to happen. Apparently their checkpoints are still very unforgiving. Oh, and this isn't even the worst part of it, viewers. In the end section, there are no checkpoints. I know this to be a goddamn fact, because I died during the end section at one time, and still died. Die, thank you. Er, I died in the end of the, uh, in that end section, and I still went back to the beginning of the end section and go through the entire fucking thing all over again. Thank God the Flood are terrible shots. Now if I can just get my shielding back. 
find enemies who don't immediately run all the way up onto my nuts and then blow me up. guys are actually very easy, but point, uh, going for a point blank is slightly risky considering when they fall they explode. <laughs> 